PCB design is a delicate balance where every component plays its part. The problem is that a missing piece can jeopardize an entire project. In this tutorial, we walk you through the steps you need to take to ensure your project remains manufacturable at every stage, from part selection, during the design phase, and even after your design is finalized. Let's get started. When selecting parts for your project, beyond just technical specifications, it's crucial to consider two often overlooked factors, pricing and availability. While you may find the perfect component for your design, it's vital to ensure it's both affordable and available. After all, the best component on paper won't help if it's out of stock or over budget. In Flux, you can quickly check pricing and availability directly from the parts search in the library. As an extra tip, make sure your parts are available in more than one supplier, as stock levels can change quickly. As the design progresses, it's important to stay informed about each component status and don't be caught off guard. In Flux, you can quickly change information about the part at the project level or even at individual parts. Pressing information is available in Spectre on the right, so you can stay informed at any point in your development. When the design phase is wrapped up, it might be tempting to relax and take a backseat, but the component market is dynamic and can change at any time. Staying proactive post-design is crucial. Flux provides regular alerts and updates in availability and cost, so you can anticipate and not react. You can set your email notification preferences by adding three properties. Those properties are price change threshold, lead time change threshold, and price notification frequency. With pricing notification frequency, you can set up how often you want to receive those email notifications. With lead time change threshold, you can set the percentage that your lead time needs to change in order for an email notification to be triggered. Similarly, price change threshold sets the percentage in price change that needs to happen for an email notification to be triggered. By default, the frequency is set to weekly, the lead time change threshold is set to 5%, and price change threshold is set to 1%. By following these few principles, you'll be much better prepared to keep your process manufacturable and ahead of the ever-changing electronic components market. See you in the next one.